An estimated 13,000 people are trapped in modern slavery in the UK. That's 35 people a day. Who are bought and sold as commodities. These are people from all over the world, including from here in the UK. Slavery does not discriminate. It affects people of all faiths, races, genders and life experiences. People like you and me who just want to get a job. Or want to provide a better life for their family. Or simply dream of finding love and acceptance. Are taken advantage of. Through lies, through violence, through taking advantage of vulnerability. People's freedom is taken away and replaced with control. Men, women and children find themselves working in places they never imagined. Pop-up brothels, illegal cannabis farms, or as servants in houses, to name but a few. It's hard to imagine how desperate and afraid someone might feel. But people do escape, and we in the UK are getting better at spotting the signs and helping people get out. The journey of recovery begins as the government provides a short time of support and safety. But this comes to an abrupt end. Individuals are left vulnerable to re-exploitation. With many ongoing issues and unanswered questions. Where to go. Who to trust. Who to talk to. And even where to live. At the Snowdrop Project, we help answer those questions. Having the support means that um, when I'm overwhelmed with things, I can ring up. So you have like a caseworker who supports you with like all the legal, all the you know paperwork side of bureaucracy sort of stuff. But then they also team you up with a befriender who like you can get to do fun stuff with. So um, you might you know go and have coffee or or just uh, go for a walk or just catch up. It's good to just have that sort of someone there that's just a, a friend. The Ktu ne snowdrop mi fjal vich do vich do jav vin English by kursin per English Ktu the vin psikolog ersh nje per menimin tem ni mama male per mu ersh se pse kto per nje jav per nje koshum te shkurter me djetem psikolog se on kisha shum ne voj nat ko kisha shum shum ketch. Ash një persona pas ta fat që më man gocen dersa unë përfundoj seancen, që mos ta shpu seancen e psikologut dhe të shikoj femijen tim, dhe kjo që mund sot fal snowdropit. They don't just work like it's my job, but they do things with their heart. They've helped me a lot. They helped me, my case workers. When I was trying to fix my document, they helped me, and when I was taking, filling the form for different offices, taking my form to different places, so they were there. When I was moving my house, moving my stuff, they painted my house, they put the furniture, they did everything. After when they're done and they gave me the key, I got there, everything was like, I couldn't believe it was my flat. So it was so amazing and wonderful. I do the total group on Tuesdays. We started having like four ladies mostly. Now it's the full room and we, we keep having people in waiting lists. <laughs> they play, free play, and then uh, we do some teaching. So the, the kids learn the letters, the numbers, the colors, counting, and then we do some singing. It's an opportunity for ladies to meet each other. They can sit and relax and the kids can play. And then they will take up to the knee and they will do the singing and the teaching. It's not helping only the moms. They are helping the kids. Because if the moms feel great, the kids will feel better. Everything is related. Mm -hmm. கொஞ்சம் <laughs> When I realized the support for me here in the snowdrop, I was so excited because 
I was very lonely at the time. Yeah, I had nobody to support me because the safe house had stopped supporting me after getting the negative CD from the home office. Mm. So when they accepted me and told me the reasons why they believed I was a victim of human trafficking, I was so excited and it really boosted my faith. I used to sometimes lock myself in the room because I wouldn't want to go out. But with Snowdrop, I'm feeling much better. I can even come here for dancing. They're a lifeline, really. Like without, without them, like none of us, none of us would probably be be here at all. Um, they kind of, they're like the hope, kind of. You know, they're like the light at the end of a very dark tunnel. Um, that kind of just show you that there could possibly be something after trafficking or um, whatever it is you've come from you know, that there could be something more.